Hello everyone, this is Manaiki Chandler. Thank you for connecting. I've been asked about this video a lot about uh, actor Jung Hae Ying. I'm gonna do a general reading for him. This will be all about his energies, uh, his career, and love life. So let's start right away. Let's... Okay, I got these four cards. A lot of cards have been wanting to jump out. Um, okay. I feel like he went from a period of not having enough, like um, a period of, of austerity in his life, and then all of a sudden, all of his cups got filled, filled up. But I feel like sometimes he doesn't know how to deal with all of this. He's quite sensitive, so he needs to resource to his own intuition most of the time. I feel that he was very well nurtured by his mother. But at the same time, I feel like his mother was very strong. Like, she had a very strong personality. I feel that there was someone in particular in the industry that helped him out. Maybe a female producer, an older woman that took him under her care. I feel like he does doing things with his hands. Like, he does, he likes experimenting a lot. And he likes touching in order to to feel things, to sense things. So for him to know about something, he needs to touch it a lot because his hands have a lot of power. I feel that he likes the color white a lot. Like he wears a lot of white. It just makes him feel uh, clean. He might be quite conservative as well. I feel that when he sees something of interest, he doesn't jump at it right away. He's, he's careful. He's got a great tact. I feel like he might explore in something that has to do with hands, like maybe a restaurant, a bar, uh, maybe even uh, DJing. Okay, we have the Ten of Wands, Eight of Cups, Three of Swords. Yeah, he's very careful about things. I feel it has something to do with growing up. I feel like maybe he's got a, a very strict parent. I feel like his heart has been broken in the past and he needs to make amends with, with himself. Yeah. And so he's learned to be very practical and very reasonable. To not, not let himself be carried by his, by his emotions. So by all of this, I'm, I'm feeling that he will need to meet someone that is very open-hearted. That will be the gene to his junk. But I do feel that under all those layers of uh, strictness that he has built for himself, there's a lot of lightness. I think that at, at some point, he will want to just experience life to the fullest, to be more open and experimental. Let's see about his career. He's very hermetic. He doesn't open up that easily. He's got a lot of walls and doors. In his career, I feel like there's still a lot of room for him to experience. There's a lot of ground that he will experience and experiment again. Yes. He can be very secretive, so he keeps he things for himself a lot, which bring him a lot of headaches and unpleasant nights. Two of Pentacles repeated, and the High Priestess again. We have the Ten of Pentacles, so he's definitely always staying afloat, always staying busy, and ready to take his going places he's definitely working in, in his larger global productions in the future his career started slow but steadily he started receiving more and more offers because he's a very diligent person very he's got a lot of credibility yes at the beginning he was struggling and he didn't receive uh, many offers and he wasn't really getting what he wanted. 
maybe he might have this at some point he decided to change companies because I, I see him living and maybe this will happen again that at some point he will find himself uh, wanting to do different things that working where he is working is not enough for him he's a very neat person very careful but I think that sometimes there's a bit of a mesh in his head and most of the limitations that he experienced were created by his own self he will want to experience somewhere else maybe in other countries and um in asia before jumping to a bigger scale yes i definitely see him participating in, in chinese movies as his next step yeah so he will want he will have to change his residence for a little while let's see about um a love reading Let's start with the love reading for actor Jung Hae In. Let's go. Okay, we have the High Priestess. Again, we have the Page of Swords and the Ten of Swords. I see someone being very secretive about his personal life. He doesn't really talk about it. He doesn't like anyone else knowing about what he's experiencing. He's very careful about that part of his life. So don't try to even ask. <laughs> Well, there's something about uh, purple flowers. There's a common ground with them. Maybe his special one likes uh, lilies, maybe. Okay. We have the Emperor. Two of Wands. Three of Wands. I mean, Knight of Wands. Three of Wands. And the Eight of Wands, so much fire, so much passion, so much interest. There's definitely someone in his mind. There's something going on with someone and they are communicating. I still don't have much information about her. I feel like he wants everything about this person to be kept under Devin Keys. Like he wants her. He wants her all for himself. This feels really new. This feels like fresh, like it's in the early stages. I don't think you will see and know much about them. They will go on retreat to separate themselves from what's going on. Oh my god, so many ones. And so much fire. So much passion between these two. I feel that they would tr travel to other cities in order to be together. Like go to the countryside. I feel that they would even go to places where there is not even a uh, signal or internet connection to escape from everyone. I feel like he's been traveling a lot, traveling a lot to see this person. You know what? I just received a glimpse of this person, and this person does no one to be bothered. Please remain <laughs> where you are. Like, you don't want to cross this person. Okay, we have the eight of wands again. This person seems like an artist as, as well. Seems like a very outgoing, uh, fun person that does not want to be involved in any kind of uh, rumor or anything. I feel that this person is fire sign. It's a fire sign. I am receiving a lot of Sagittarius in her chart from her. And I believe he is also a fire sign. He is an Aries. And uh, that's a, quite an explosive. Wow. <laughs> quite an explosive combination. Very passionate. Very eventful. This person is quite sassy and strong will and strong minded. She's quite captivating and attractive. This person is giving me a bit of earthy vibes as well because. I can see her connection to nature. I feel like he takes a lot of photographs of her. He likes how down to earth and simple she can be. He just doesn't want to see her go, so he's taking care of this relationship. This person is definitely checking all the boxes for him. They have a very good romantic life, if you know what I mean. 
love it i love it a lot of fire a lot of leo as well from her they are very playful there's a lot of chemistry physical chemistry yes a lot of interest a lot of love this is in the early stages as i'm saying and um he's gonna ask her to be his girlfriend let's check my romance angels oracle cards i feel like they are both very energetic like they have a routinary life they wake up early in the morning they have a, a cup of, of espresso they read their magazine or the newspaper and i'm ready to work I keep seeing purple flowers. She might like a lot of uh, lilies or purple flowers, lavender, maybe. They might like that uh, that fragrance. I feel that they will have retreats with friends as as well. I feel like some people in the industry know, and they are helping all of this to be kept under seven volts. I keep seeing this from them. I think they dance a lot. They touch a lot. They enjoy themselves. A lot of lavender color again. Maybe that color is, is a sign for you guys to find out who this person is. Jay, how beautiful. Lavender again. Oh my god, this is a scene within their lives. It's so undeniable, the connections, all of the things going on for them. They, they're, they are all... They're going to make it work. This is going to last enough for them. And under the deck, honeymoon. Oh my god. Of course, the escape. They escaped the city. And everyone wanting to uh, intervene in their secret affairs. <laughs> well, it's, it's something personal. It's something for them. So they are enjoying it as much as they can. They will have a splendid relationship. I really wish them the best. I wish for this relationship to soar to thrive and i wish uh jong Hae-in a lot of wealth and life in his life so i'm gonna leave the reading right here thank you so much for watching and connecting with me uh thank you for your likes your comments and for subscribing to my channel so i i'll see you on the next video take care bye